I think that Super Control X to do this is is too much. And if you bring your fingers off wrong, I mean, I, I know they're trying to write a way around it. Now, when you look at your keyboard on your computer, you've got keys you never use. You never use them, but they're different for everybody. Now, so I wrote a script that allows you to choose the key. And I don't want to use three keys. I want to use one key. But I've got keys I never touch. You're all different and you've all got different keyboards. So this script, if it works, because we're going to do it for the first time here live. So let's just open up a thingy. Let's go into downloads. Should allow you to pick the key that you want to use. One key, not a triple key. So let's just do that over the top. Now, I've got two of the two versions, but I'll install the one. I did one called Toggle. And what that meant was it was either on or it's either off. You didn't have to hold it, so it stayed on. But this one's different. This is press to talk, but it's done in a different way. So chmod plus x and then oh, plus x, he says. There we want that one. Drag it over there. And then we want to run it. So you get some options. So you get press any key to bind interactively you get press a modify key to come or you can just restore it back to the original way so i want to use my windows copilot key on my keyboard as my press to talk button so i need to press one a small window will open press the key you want to use and then windows will close after five seconds so let's do that press that one and a window pops up you see it below so now i press my copilot key leave it and there it goes detected key whatever whatever you use that as my push to talk so yep okay that's it so now i should be able to do this testing one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and there you go so you've got some choices on there so we just run it again 